everyone welcome back for more exos us content today's video we're going to discuss what or who are you going to summon for if you have a gold fate court ticket so right now all of us have one some of you guys probably spent it already but for those who have not um summoned uh, from their gold fate core selection ticket um i'm going to tell you um a few tips before you summon for a hero for that selection ticket so i'm going to go to my inbox i still have mine i haven't i have been contemplating on what to or who to get so if you can see the gold fate core selection ticket here um there are a few um notable things that you should consider uh before you summon for someone or a hero or probably a favorite hero please do listen to me first before you summon for a hero so number one if you are a beginner um there are only two heroes that i'm going to recommend uh, that you summon beginner meaning you just started the game today or a couple of days ago or probably a month or or two weeks ago or you're planning to start the game now so the best um, heroes that you're going to summon for are number one would be Bathory because you can't go wrong with Bathory skills she's a good support for any um, any content whether it be PvP or PvE uh, she's very good in PvP and for PvE um, she actually gives you Tranquil which gives you more survivability and um, uh, Frost is actually needed as well in the PvE content especially in the chapters so number one you have Bathory good for PvP and PvE the second one would be FC Tantalo because FC Tantalo gives you again a lot of support I'm actually endorsing support teams because support heroes you can just put them you know with any team composition and they would basically go so these two are very good with anyone that you would put them together with so for tantalo again he is very very good in pvp and also in pve wherein you will need to break um, nature guardian stones he has damage over time in which is very valuable in pve and pvp content so there you go for beginners the next is these are the players that have been have been playing more than a month usually they need um, they need to plug in holes in the roster so you need to fill in some roles you need to fill in um, um, some some skills that you need one example is actually if you don't have a hero that gives you mana um, the two that I would recommend you pull from this banner would be Iris and the other one another option would be shell so shell is would be better with fc genai but she is actually still good without fc genai for her s i think it's her s2 for fc iris you can't go wrong with her she's top in pvp right now and she is a good support for pve as well so these are the things that you need to plug your holes with um, in terms of if you need um, mana producers in your team so the next category more or less is on if you are just just want to fill in your roster it would really depend on the nation that you are focusing on so i would suggest that you focus on one nation so if you need for example um i'll start with uh, with uh north one frosty so north one frosty if you don't have iris uh you can actually get shufraken but he's no longer in the meta so for Lenombe right now it's usually april or it's usually um uh, rachel so again there will be holes in your roster so the missing heroes that you need you may get them now because um like on 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 this main account um but oh, sorry but for me I, I i don't have any holes anymore most of these these heroes i have their sc or all of them i have their fc but for those who want to complete um their synergy with the rosters you can actually get them right now to complete your synergy for my free to play account i i think got um who did i get i forgot 
I got... Uh, let me remember. Let me remember. Rara. I got Rara because I'm currently summoning for Bathory in, in the stream creation. That's why I didn't get Bathory. So I, I, I was lacking either Rara or Bathory in my free-to-play account. Now I have Rara, but I still have to pull for Bathory. That, so you have to know the needs of your roster. Who are the characters that... Uh, who are the heroes that you think will help you. So those are the ones for me and last is if you have all of them ready you, again you, you just have to make sure that you focus on one signature force and also you actually get more copies especially of your generals like for example in this account that i have i i'm focusing right now on garf and on rudley and I'm actually I'm actually considering getting Rudley for my team because I need him right now. He I don't have copies of him. It's really hard to get Rudley and I'm right now developing Wasted Red. I have multiple copies of Bathory, Tantalo, Herrera, Iris, the rest, but most of the copies are even Janai and Shell I have multiple copies. But right now I'm really I really want to focus on one signature force and i have to build garf and rudley and put down in the comments below if you think if i get ready now it's a good decision for me or if if i should go with another fc for my gold fate core selection ticket so that's it guys it's more of all of these heroes are good all of these heroes are 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 important or will play a big role in your roster you just have to find out or find out what specific signature force you're going to focus in what hero you're going to focus in and what heroes you still need so it really would depend on on what is the state of your roster but again it will depend on what nation or what or who uh, or what hero you're focusing to build with now and for your future matches so again also consider that you have to build your rosters based on your progression in pvp and also in pve okay so this is it for me guys anyway guys y'all stay safe take care this is the warden and i'm out